Hello people of the internet, it is me again. I know it's been a while since I made a video, it's just because I didn't really feel like making any other videos and I wasn't really sure what kind of video I should make. And I decided I'm going to do my nails today, so why not do a video on how to do nails. And I already did this hand, and um, it's um an ombre effect, like red and pink, and then some glitter. And I So um, if you want to know how to, or learn how to get these nails, and just keep on watching. Yeah. So you always want to have like a placemat when you're doing like your nails and stuff, just so that like you don't get anything anywhere. And I just decorated mine a bit because I uh, felt like it. So I just took my nail polish off from the one nail so I could show you. And I have all the other ones to compare it to. So what you really need, like, okay, so first what, you're supposed, what you should do is you should take a pink or like whatever color you want to do and you should just put that over the nail, like, just one thing, other, like, you know what I mean. So you just want to do that, just put pink on it, and then let that dry, actually. Okay, mine's not completely dry, but I'm very impatient, so I'm just going to do this now. But you just want to take your red, and you just want to, like, dab it on, like, the top half, at least, like, like that, just, like, dab it on. You know, it, and it's okay if it gets, like, messy, because you can always clean it up with, um, some nail polish remover and, like, a paper towel, or I just have this really old paintbrush that I use to just dip in my nail polish remover and clean that up. Then you want to, uh, let that dry for- Okay, so while my nail was drying, I actually was just putting nail polish on the placemat, because I just, I don't know. And it's not completely dry yet, but you don't really want it to be completely dry. But like when you're done with that, just take some more of the pink and dab it underneath and mix it in a bit with the um the other thing. So And I just got nail polish on my arm. Of course I do. So like I was saying, <laughs> sorry about that, I just um put my arm into the nail polish and but you just wanna like dab some of the pink nail polish over where you already had the pink and mix it in a bit with the red. So I accidentally put too much nail polish on this, but like that. And like after you do that, if you do have a paintbrush, it actually helps so much to get like the actual like ombre effect. But after you put the pink on, you don't want don't let it dry, but take some more red and dab that on over the pink because I accidentally uh, smeared it over my entire nail, but you do want to do this anyway, just so that it's more vibrant. And you mostly really want the red to be vibrant, because it's kind of hard to see it through the pink. And if you do have, like, a paintbrush or something, just, like, dab it over that and make, like, the, a really good, like, ombre effect. And next is the best part of all, the glitter. I just have this, um, glitter here. Like, you can't really see the blue part, but you mostly just need, like, a top coat over it. It doesn't even really have to be glitter, and you just want to put, like, a bunch of that over it. And, get, and then after you do that, you do not want to let it dry. We're going to have everything dry afterwards. You want to take some more red and put that over it, just so it's a bit more vibrant. And then I actually went over the pink a bit, too, and some more of the red. And then after you do that, you just want to put another thing of glitter over it. I actually had to do my whole entire nail over again because I put too much nail polish on. But I just went over it and you want to do the same things. You just don't really want to put a lot of nail polish on. I put too much. But in the end, it should look something like this. It should just look something like this. Sorry if I know the lighting's look kind of bad, but um. It's just, uh, yeah. So I hope you guys liked this video. I was trying something different and please comment down below if you did like it and give it a thumbs up and please subscribe and um, the usual stuff if you want to. Um, yeah, so bye!